Hey, how are we all doing? Welcome to this Enlightened Video Lead tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to um, use an adjustment layer to color grade your clips. So I've just really took some sort of throwaway B-roll this morning um, just to put in something somewhere. And what I tried to do was sort of have a couple of, just a, a couple of different clips with totally different lighting and sort of different colors. Um, so I suppose what I would do first with this, let's let's make this the canvas square. Okay, so I'm just going to go format, and then go one by one, and then so there's a couple of ways now that I can get this video clip to fit into the canvas. I can obviously highlight it and pinch and squeeze and um, select the part of the. Um, screen that I want in the in the square format or I can go to um, again select the clip go to transform button at the bottom and I can just click fill so then that will just um, fill the canvas with that clip and likewise just do you know go to the next clip and click fill again and then the next one highlight it click fill again so that's the easiest way to fill the canvas like like so I'm going to click um, filters and I'm going to drag this filter out so it covers all of my timeline like so it'll just snap into place like this and then I'm going to go to presets um, and then I can choose one of the presets so I've already got filters with one of the presets and I'm just going to use these RE I'm going to try this RE2 or RE1 and the reason I want to use these is because it gives me a nice sort of sheen feel or a vintage feel sort of sheen over the over the um the image and this is the sort of look that i'm looking for for this so you just have to be careful and and check um just just be careful with the preset that you use and just check that it sort of suits the sort of look that you're looking for now um i'm going to add that adjustment layer so i'm going to click back and back again and then i'm going to go for the adjustment and again, drag this out for the duration of my um, my clips. And now what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this clip here to set set the sort of tone for the feel that I, I really want. So let's highlight exposure. And now, obviously, if I bring the exposure up, it's going to lighten everything up. So, But for now, I just want to take the exposure down a little bit, okay? And then I'm going to go to contrast. And I'm going to drag the contrast up. So this just makes the edges darker and the darks darker as well and then brightness let me drag the brightness sort of to where a position where i'm happy with and it's just up just a tiny bit because i've got the exposure down at the moment but we might change that in a minute saturation to want to increase the saturation on this you know if you go overly saturated especially on some clips it's not look, going to look great um vibrance i'm going to leave and then the warmth i want a bit of a, a sort of yellow tinge to this i don't want any tint in it i don't want to mess with the hue um, and then the offset. So the offset is like the um, almost like the black point. And again, I just want to have this sort of nice matte feel over the um, over the image. So now, if I um, if I want to show you what it looks like without both of these on. So this is what it started like. And this is where we're at currently, okay? Let me show you on the the yellow one as well, or the yellow field as well. So this is where it's at. This is what it started like. If I just have my adjustment layer, so you notice with just my adjustment layer, I've got this. So what I can do, let's, let's not go back, let's not talk about the feel that I want in terms of presets. Let's talk about sort of um, color grading. And this is sort of your standard, what you would try and achieve in, in FCPX or some of the um, more pro-like apps. So the exposure, I'm gonna just bring the exposure up just a touch. Contrast, this is coming up as well. Um, quite a little bit more though. And again, I'll just have a look around the clip to see what is happening with my contrast and and yeah, I do want that to um, to really sharpen that out. Brightness, so I'd probably take at the brightness. I'll take it away again. It just depends what feel. I'm just taking a little bit of the brightness away. And then the saturation, 
Um, I'd probably take a little bit of that away as well. Um, warmth, bring a bit of bit of warmth, really, really small bit of warmth into it. And then the offset, I'd give it that sort of, um, that professional sort of sheen or that sort of professional overlay. So this is, this is what it looks like with my adjustment layer on top. So this is without, and this is with. So you can see the differences there with just that adjustment layer. Let me, let me just remove that preset for now. So I've shown you with a preset and with an adjustment layer, and now we're just at that adjustment layer level. So you see really nicely what's happened here. I'm just gonna let this play through this clip. So you can just see the difference and you see it more so down here in these dark parts, dark parts of the video where it really brightens and I've really got the sort of image to start popping. And then I suppose you could have a, add a, like a little bit of vignette to that, um, add a little bit of music to it and you're, um, and you're laughing, but, but yeah, that's, um, that's adding an adjustment layer and, and sort of color grading your image using video loop. I hope this helped you out. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I'll, um, I'll speak to you all again soon. Bye.